All right, guys, welcome back. Episode four of the Monaco series. Uh, episode six in total. Did the math right. Um, we're on a new lake. We're on Tawanda Lake. Um, it's actually just north of uh, Johnson Lake that we haven't fished yet this year, but we often fished the last couple years. Um, very small lake, but it's about a 27 foot hole in the middle. Um, it's known for musky, walleye, both species of bass. So we'll kind of see what we come across here. Um, it's We don't know much about it. We do have a lake map on it, but other than that, that's kind of all we got. So uh, it's a little after five. It's foggy, it's a little cooler. Water temp's only 69 and a half. So it's gonna be a little bit different experience, but uh, we'll figure it out. Uh, hopefully we catch something. Crappy in there. Perch in here. Or six or uh, yeah. Oh, I'm being a success. There we go. Some decent sized pumpkin seed there. Just set it down. It's a nice crappie. I don't know what was vibrating. Yeah. Oh. Nice. Oh, that was I was like, what? Nothing's going on. There's another one up there. You just pop something small up that way. There was two or three following it when he hit it. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, let me get one more out of there. Man, these are some nice crappies though. Nick? Musky. Hey, check that out. 
that a fish or weeds? That's a fish. Weeds don't swim. I believe there is a fish on that. <laughs> hey, you can catch them casting. I'll make you pull behind you. Oh yeah. Ooh. Hey. Alright guys, so that's going to do it for Tawanda Lake, I think, it's, I think it's how you pronounce it, I don't know, never really heard anybody say it, so, um, but we've got 25, which is pretty good for a lake that we've never been on before, um, nothing really too exciting, but it's a decent numbers lake if we had to, so we can make it work, but, um, we're going to go to Upper Gresham tonight, we're going to go to probably Gunlock in the morning, um, we will, what are we at? So 25, uh -huh. that puts us at One, seven. 117. Yep. So we got 117 in the boat out of the 200 we were trying to get. Um, that's not too bad with two trips to go that we have some high numbers out of. So 83, right, that's, that's kind of doable. Um, we'll see what happens. It's going to be close. It's going to be a good run. But we will be at Upper Gresham tonight. We are hopefully going to have everything appropriately charged. We had some camera battery life issues and some the boat didn't get charged overnight. So we're kind of all over the board. We're going to go regroup, go home, eat some food, and then we will be out again. And we'll see you guys momentarily.